This is a shameless intro card. Now let's review some toys. Han Solo, one of the most iconic characters in film history. Whether you know him as the man who saved Luke's butt at the Death Star, the guy who shot Darth Vader and lived, or maybe you just know him as one of the guys who helped train Rey, and he's not even a Jedi. He's seen many Funko releases before, but what about The Force Awakens Funko of Han Solo? Old Man Han. He's like Old Man Logan, but without the claws. Now, I just want to say, I love Episode 7, and I really loved Han in this movie, so I was really excited that this came out, and I definitely had to get it. This Funko is a little bit older. Uh, it came out around the time of The Force Awakens, but y'all know I wasn't really reviewing toys back then, so let's take a look at it. And one of my favorite Star Wars films, The Force wakes up from a 30 year long nap. Alright, so let's take her out of the box here, and one thing I would like to say again, and I will never get tired of saying it about the Star Wars Funko Pops, is that them being bobbleheads Seriously, I don't care that they're bobbleheads. I really don't care, but it makes it very hard to get them out of this box for me. I, again, I don't know if it's the gorilla-like hands, the lack of hand-eye coordination, possibly the generally low IQ that I possess, but uh, wow. This one, just like Saw Gerrera, it was a process. I'm not kidding, I edited this footage. It was a process of me trying to get it out of here. I love the figure, but holy cow. I need some help or something. But anyway, taking it out here, we just take a brief look. You can see that it's really detailed on the front. Um, it's not the most detailed Funko Pop ever, but it's much more detailed than the Star Wars ones used to be, and I really like it. I thought it was pretty accurate to the movie um, and to the, the outfit that he wore on set during The Force Awakens. I thought that the hair was done really well. Um, They've done a good job of actually centering the bobblehead heads, which they didn't used to do. And something I want to show you guys is just like, this is the old Han Solo Funko. Now there have been multiple, but you can see that like this new one is much more detailed. And it's the same with like Palpatine. Look at this old Palpatine. Uh, Chewie, he's a little older, not too old. The old Darth Vader one, like, you look at the new Darth Vader. Man, it is just insane how much more they have put effort into the Star Wars line. Like, you can totally see that they're doing better with their molds. They're putting more actual detail into these figures. And, like, they really are trying to make, like, better products. I mean, I've always liked Funko. But when they first started out, their characters were a little less detailed than they are now. Like, you can see from the pictures that I've shown you guys just compared to this one. So honestly, I'm really happy with the Han Solo figure. Uh, I thought it was great. I love that he has his blaster in there. He's got his nice leather jacket. He's ready to go. I thought this was awesome, and I just wanted to share it with you. Thanks a lot, guys, and I love you. I'll be seeing you next time.